Hey Bobcat Nation, are you interested in becoming a teacher and wondering what the teaching program is like at Quinnipiac? I'll show you in this Quinnipiac Stay in the Life. My name is Stephanie and I'm from New York and I'm majoring in interdisciplinary studies for elementary education with a minor in psychology. I always kind of knew I wanted to be a teacher. I was just really passionate about working with kids and inspiring them to want to learn. I think this program really solidified my love for teaching. Also, I decided to minor in psychology because I thought it would be really beneficial kind of understand the students' minds. I think Quinnipiac has been an amazing fit for me. All the professors have been by my side, step by step. They really prepare you for the future and I feel 100% ready to get into the classroom. I'm about to leave for my first and only class, which is Cognitive Psychology. It talks a lot about the brain, what kind of goes on, and it's really beneficial to my major. I wanted to talk about our future teachers organization. I'm currently the president of the organization. Hi, I'm Josh Delgado and I am STEPS co-VP of <laughs> QFTM. So our organization does a lot of awesome stuff for the MAT students. We go into elementary schools and middle schools and gain a lot of experience, especially for freshmen and sophomores who aren't student teaching yet. It's a great way to get into the classroom early. Right now, we are dropping off some holiday presents for students. We're able to sponsor six kids this year. We bought 10 gifts per kid and we're gonna go drop it off to them. It's for kids whose parents aren't as fortunate enough to buy them presents for the holiday season, so we are happy to help when we can. So I just finished getting ready for my field study. I'm going to Fairhaven School. I'm in a sixth grade class. We observe the teacher, teach the lessons, we take notes, we help the students one-on-one. -on -one. I go there once a week for two hours. Both juniors and seniors do their field study. Juniors mostly observe and seniors get the chance to be more involved in the classroom. Today I was in a science and social studies class and I was just helping the students do their work. For science they were learning about organisms and carbon dioxide and for social studies they were learning about Cleopatra and ancient Egypt so I was just helping them with that activity and reading articles and answering questions. I had a lot of fun. It was my last day in that classroom so I was a little bit sad. I really made connections with the students and I'm really happy that I got that experience. I wanted to tell you a little bit about how Quinnipiac sets up the field study program. Junior year, you would be in a suburban area, and senior year, they'd like to put you in an urban area just so you get to have both experiences, so you're prepared for whatever may come. Also, senior year, if you are majoring in elementary, the first semester, you'll be given upper elementary. So for example, I'm in sixth grade. But next semester, I'll be getting lower elementary, so that's like first through fourth. That's also really great that they let you get all of those different experiences so you can kind of figure out what you like. I got home from field study and I've just been working on some homework. So I'm currently working on a lesson plan for my education in science class. So we plan our own lesson. We create the activities, we get the resources, and we pretty much do whatever we want based on the specific topics. For example, I'm doing my lesson on earth science, specifically the planets, and I can pick any activities. I can have my students ask questions and then do a fun hands-on modeling activity. We write a lot of lesson plans throughout the semester just to get the practice in, and I think it's really helpful because at this point, I'm like a pro at writing lesson plans, so <laughs> I can write them pretty quickly now. So I'm really glad that Quinnipiac has such extensive practice on this. I'm excited to learn more about being the best teacher that I can be, and I'm very excited to be a teacher. Be sure to check out other Quinnipiac Day in the Life videos to see Quinnipiac all for yourself. Go Bobcats!